back, guys. I went a little bit slack some of his uploads, but uh, we're back, baby. He's on. We're good, aren't we? And we're flirty. We're back. We're good. We're good. We're confident. We're good. Few changes the way we're doing videos, but we're, we're back. You can see we're actually uh, Tassie Spirit currently. And uh, yeah, we're on the way to Winton. So, high tech round three this weekend. Gonna be sick. Feeling pretty good, actually. Like, we've actually driven. It's been like probably the most drive I've ever done. So, it's like four out of the last five weekends. So hopefully that pays a little bit of dividends, but I'm definitely pretty warm in the seat. Made a few changes for the car a little bit. Uh, this round they've got like a bit of a different layout. They're actually running Winton backwards, and like downhill into the S's. Which I think should be really cool. Um, but a bit of a tricky layout because they've actually got like a, like a mungy with like two mungies on the way down into turn one. And then a mungy coming out of the last corner, which I think will make things pretty interesting, particularly like when you're actually chasing other cars. So I did a fair bit of chase practice in my car a couple of weeks ago, just out at the supercar round, um, with guys on 235s and stuff like that as well, just to try and like, you know, be in a high gripped up car and chase like some slow boys on slow tires and still try and make it work. So I really working on some like technique with like handbrake, foot brake and car set up to be able to like, kind of do that. And I think that will be like pretty critical this weekend. I'm trying to like chase a car like in a straight line while it's munging. You got heaps of grunt and smoke and stuff, particularly like slow cars, it's gonna be pretty hard. So yeah, I'm keen, I'm confident. Are you keen, Fletty? I'm keen as. Yeah, this is the boat anyway. If anyone hasn't been, this is the lovely Tasmanian spirit. Uh, we're actually up the top floor at the moment, uh, enjoying a bit of a, a bit of a beverage. Uh, Fletcher might be on some rocket leg here in a minute. He absolutely loves, loves his rocket leg. We're going to do the most important thing on the boat is can we get a beer? Because all the kids have taken rocket league away from me filled it all up all the chairs there's, a, there's an xbox in the middle but now nah, i can't use it because there's no bloody chairs is there so we're probably gonna get probably gonna get a pizza maybe a little snack a beer sit down look at the view if you can't see it's really good out there um but like i said he brought his rod so we might be able to go for a fish <laughs> uh, just got to the track, good little uh, thing, what's going on. Oh, it's been raining overnight. Hopefully the weather's not too bad this weekend, but not too fast, as long as it's not patchy. Track looks more wakey than I thought it was going to. Um, I guess we, they did like a little track layout, and they released that all the clips going to be. And all of us were like, oh, come on, just single click it. But seriously, this is right. massive. This is going to be like a... 200k entry, I reckon. No runoff. So we've got like a, where the start line is, or you can see kind of like the line telling over. First clip, second clip, I think it's just before one time it's cut through. Third out clip's here. This section's gonna be fairly sketchy, I reckon, being so downhill. This will be easy for here, flat out. And it's like absolutely no runoff. So like, I don't know where you can see, but pretty much a huge spoon drain. Uh, on the other side of like this turn one. So, this one's going to sort the men out from the boys. It's going to be all about commitment to try and make it into this one. We are on the commitment area, I reckon, on the track. Um, it's going to be interesting how today plays out. Obviously, the track's not meant to go this direction. So, like, this, that, you definitely don't want to go through that thing sideways. Um, I feel like coming in here fast, like downhill as well, it's going to be pretty easy to overshoot. The problem I have is, like, I don't really do no commitment, it's like my biggest problem, sort of. Uh, first lap for me is probably gonna be like on this line or like in there, probably. We don't really ever do like safe little banker laps. Good to go, baby? We're good to go, let's get it. Yeah, let's go through driver's briefing. Track's wet, looks slippery, whatever. Pretty confident in the rain, no we're on. No worries. No stress. Uh, I think it's not going to rain tomorrow, but it might rain for qualifying, so we'll get a little bit of data in. Make sure the car feels good, and uh, send it home, eh? Hey. Let's get it, boy. Am I going to that gravel trap? Fuck no. Maybe. <laughs>
lunch break now. Things are kind of settled. I, I, I said I was going on that gravel trail, eh? First lap, 360, straight in it backwards. First lap, couple laps. It's all the same, isn't it? Uh, we started on a pair of scrub tyres for the wet, which probably was a little bit dumb. We ended up flicking some new ones on. The car was heaps better. But by that point in time, everyone was kind of out um, trying to get some runs in. And you sit in the line for like 15 minutes before you went, so it's kind of hard to get any consistency. But I think the last couple of laps were like fairly decent. Yeah, They've just moved qualifying until tomorrow, so all you know, testing which did in the wet is probably for nothing. But track's drying up, so we're going to go out and we're going to blaze some time. <laughs> for today. Um, if you guys are testing a few mechanicals like Pro Am still in qualifying now. Big shout out to Taters from Tassie. He's doing something sick out there. So, so cool. Obviously, didn't have the best day today. Uh, in the first few sessions, we were really struggling with the car being massively overgripped, uh, really pushing the front a lot. Um, we ended up changing the setup a little bit, made it a fair bit better. Got there for the last session. I feel like we're getting heaps closer, but probably didn't really put together like the best lap. So, pretty keen to get here first thing tomorrow. Yeah, Kieran. Do the best thing tomorrow. I think set up the cars like good now. We've got it pretty close to being in the window. Just have a bunch of laps in the morning. Just get that line dialed in. Day two, baby. We're on today. Let's go. Boys on the grid. Qualifying's about to start. Got a little bit of practice now. Quick half an hour session. Got new tyres all around. Gonna whip them off. Been having some footage from last night. Hopefully, be less of a retard today. It should be right, eh? We'll be good, I think. Yeah, we'll it's good. this, boy. It's not gonna be wet today, so it should be dry all day, so it should be sweet. Send it. Send it. Have live updates this year, so I really don't know. But I think we should be somewhere at the front. 
pretty happy with my first run. Push probably a little bit too hard in the second one. Um, but after you do a first, like a good first run, I just like, right, let's see if we can absolutely send this into turn one backwards. Didn't really work out. It kind of got a little bit wide, a little bit early, and just kind of drove out of the zone a little bit. Probably turn two and three was better than my first run. But anyway, let's see how we go. Hopefully we're up the front there somewhere. I think there's a top 24, so at least we're in the top sort of eight. We won't have to do that. We'll just do a top 16. So just qualified first. Absolutely stoked with that. It was definitely a bit of a heater, so time was going to be a good lap, and we got rewarded for it. Uh, first battle, I think. Um, we've got out there potentially either Ben Hodges or Mo Hawley. I'm doing some runs earlier with both the drivers, and they absolutely throw down. So I hope it's going to be a good one. But I'm just keen to send it. It's having so much fun. Cars running well. Um, we don't have too many dramas now, so you just be able to like back to back to back to back to back the runs. And every time I get that car, I'm just smiling. So here's me doing different drive. <laughs>
Uh, so today didn't exactly go to plan. Uh, obviously, we had a few mechanical issues um, as we were trying to like, chase that little ball joint to keep things actually going. Um, big thanks to Fletchy, Clarky, Southern Lights now. <laughs> Kept the car going all weekend. Um, had so much fun out there. It was wicked just, you know, sending it. But honestly, top four battles on. Uh, we were struggling a lot. Uh, the whole low control alarm was like popping up and down with the ball joint just being completely cooked. I actually went out to like line up against Dale. And like, as I like turned it into the pit thing, it was like pop, 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 pop. So I drove it back in, Fletchy and Clarky, pulled the front end out of it. We did it up. We tried everything we could to make it work, but it just wasn't working. We had like full variable front toe and camber out there. So car pretty much was going everywhere and I was doing some weird corrections in places. Nearly got through with Dale, got the rerun, but it was probably pretty fair because I was like using handbrake in areas that you shouldn't be using handbrake because the car would just start turning certain ways. Um, shit was happening. But anyway, we made it work. Pretty happy with third. It was pretty happy to be Jordan considering how sketchy a thing was to drive. And we actually turned the clutch out of it too. Um, just because I was like smagging it hard on the clutch to actually try and make it go around the corners because we didn't have any steer. So yeah, these cars, you can kind of drive them on the throttle a little bit, but you do need some sort of steer. And when the car's steering for you, like it's a little bit hard. But anyway, is what it is. Made it work, didn't we, Fletty? Made it work. And now we got time to go down and get a beer. We all deserve one now. Beer o'clock. <laughs> Cheers, guys.